stage one buzzer this year. Could Abby be the one to break through? Wade is really throwing body into it now. Carry the ball over. Oh man, handled that impact well. And she's got it. Abby's down here with boyfriend Joe Capo and cheering her on tonight, as well as fellow Jersey Girl training partner Rachel Dinguts. Now facing the jumping spider in a 5 3. This could be a challenge. 5 3, Matt. It can be pretty challenging, but it is doable. Dear Abby's going to write about this one. Write it. Write it. Nice. Closer to the warp wall, which has been her Achilles heel the last couple of years after clearing it back in season 10. Not able to get up the wall the previous three times she's faced it, but right now facing Tether Wall. With only about a minute left, she would really have to hustle to have a shot at finishing the course, but you know Abby wants that warp wall. She gets emotional just talking about it. I know I can do it, and I've seen myself doing it, I visualize myself doing it, and I just I just want to get to that wall. <laughs> You can see, use that lower body trying to control the momentum. Make sure your orbital will take you to that landing platform. Get on it right there. Get on it. Good job. Nice. Probably not enough time to finish, but if she can get up that wall, that would be a huge victory. It's a shorter run up to the wall in Vegas. She's going to make sure she's ready. Come on, girl. Go, 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 go. The work wall nightmare continues for Abby Clark. She's got time for one more shot. And she did it! That's a victory! I like it, man. Ran out of time, but never ran out of courage. Abby Clark kept fighting the whole way. Abby Clark has got a lot to be proud of. Just 5-3, the former gymnast stuck the landing on the jumping spider. And then, at the last second, she got what she wanted. She conquered the warp wall. Didn't get a buzzer, but a great run for Abby Clark.